David, thank you very much for taking the time to speak to us. Um, that was a disappointing one. I thought we played pretty well today. Yeah, 100%. Um, we're all frustrated in the change room because um, if you look at the game, we had the best chances, first half, and my one in the second half, which I need to score. But um, we don't take them chances. Um, we give away a penalty in the first half. And other than that, I don't feel like West Brom caused us any issues. Um, but yeah, we walk away with zero points where... where Whereas in the game, we looked like we were relatively comfortable. So, yeah, it's a frustrating one. We'll part the, the game for just a moment. For you personally, getting back involved, playing you know, a decent chunk of the game, how are you feeling out there? Um, frustrated. Um, I think we all are. Um, there's some good bits, positives and whatnot. But, yeah, like I said, um, I had a big chance in the second half that I didn't take. Um, and this... It's, it's a big one, but um, like I said, we can't dwell on it for too long because we need to start winning games. Um, it's black and white now. Um, time's running out and we need to get three points as soon as we can. Um, and that's, that's, that's the goal, that's everyone's objective and, we, and we're all on the same page. Not to, to dwell on it too much, but the, the chance you had was a, a really well worked one, sort of the way you played with, with Waggy and, and follow, followed on. That's part of your game, it's being box to box. What happened with the chance? You seemed to hit the ground rather than the ball. Yeah, um, like I said, in the second half, um, there was a lot of space in behind. Um, we'd, we'd soak up the pressure or whatnot, and then when we went back, um, the space in my hand, so I just ran forward, used my used my energy and pace, but um, yeah, I ended up kicking the ground or whatever. But yeah, it's one of them chances where it's going to play, play in your mind. For, um, but it's one of them, we've got to park it and look to Wednesday and hopefully we um, we get a result. We've just had the, the manager in here and he said that it was the first time he saw you guys playing as one of his teams, the way you were you're so solid and starting to believe in yourselves a little bit more. Do you feel that in the group? Do you feel your, your confidence level's going up a little bit? Yeah, 100%. I feel like um, you can see in the last two games, um, compared to like the Coven Burnley game, uh, we look way more solid, we're more obviously... Obviously, when a new manager comes in and it's a different style of player, what not is going to take time to adjust. But obviously, we haven't got the time. But obviously, the last two games you can see defensively, like we've looked better. Like um, we're sticking with our men, all of this. And teams haven't really last two games haven't really had clear cut chances. But um, now it's about you know our chances. We need to take them. And we need to walk away with three points because we're at around that time of the season where literally every game's a cup final. So we know that uh, we're frustrated, but. We've got to look to Wednesday now. You, you keep up bringing on Wednesday, and that's the, the thing about the Championship, isn't it? The games come around really quickly. We've had two games now. We've had a, a really solid base, defensively really good. You think we can kick on now and start putting that into practice going forward? Yeah, well, we haven't got another choice because we all know the position we're in. Um, we know we need to win games. Uh, we've got tough fixtures, um, but we can't make any excuses. Um, every game's a cup final. West Brom, obviously, fighting for for promotion or whatever same with same with Norwich so it's, it's not going to be easy but we all just need to stick together give 100% and see what happens The fact that you can come somewhere like here where a team's playing really well and got a really good home record and, and play them and perhaps be the, even the better team in the second half mm. that'll give you the belief won't it these last few games against teams at the same end of the table that we can more than compete against them Yeah 100% um, I feel like yeah we have a tough fixture list but in this league, anything can happen, anyone's beatable. So um, we've literally just got to give 100%. We need to work for each other and hopefully we can we can upset a few teams. Perfect, David. Thank you very much for your time. Cheers. Excellent.